this is our main course class and today we will be discussing the rest portion of drama from the chapter the diary of a space traveler if you remember in the last class we discussed about sentence and four kinds of sentences okay so what were the four kinds of sentences can you recollect yes that is declarative sentence imperative sentence interrogative sentence and exclamatory sentence so today we will be discussing about question tags i know that this topic you have heard it before and have learned this before but still we will be discussing about this in this section so what do you mean by question tag question tags are short questions that are added at the end of a sentence to see if the listener agrees with us so let's discuss about our question tag the next that we are going to discuss is about question tags so what do you mean by question tags they are short questions added at the end of a sentence to see if the listener agrees with us okay so one sentence in the last step that is called question tag and it is a small question okay to see whether the listener is agreeing with us or not nammal parayana kaaryam listener agree cheyunnundo ad ariyan vendiyana we use question tag okay now there is a comma before a question tag question tag the last il varumba and the front il oru comma ga now to change this or how to make question tag we should know some of the thing that they are you have to know whether the given sentence then the sentence are the positive sentence or no or the negative sentence or no okay you know whether it is positive statement or negative statement okay then you should know about the verb be form verb be form like is are was where all these things you should know then subject and pronoun because the pronoun in the question tag should agree with the subject in the sentence okay so subject according to the subject the pronoun will be changed so you should know subject and pronoun fourth one is you should know the simple present tense and past tense so if you know all these things then i'm sure question tag is going to be very easy for you so now let's understand this our question tag with some of our examples okay let's see So first example Sita is a tall girl and we said that we should know first we said that we should know whether our given sentence is a positive statement or negative statement now this is what kind of statement this is a positive statement because there is no not over there okay now she Sita is a tall girl this is a positive statement so positive statement the question tag will be a negative one okay negative statement the question tag will be a positive one remember that so here we have positive statement okay then we have question tag should be our negative one and to make question tag negative we have to take the verb be form which is the verb over here be is okay so we will make is okay if we are it is are then we will use are if it is there was then we will use was now here it is is so is adathade nammal ide negative aakana so we write the contracted form okay is in okay contracted form ana we are using so contraction okay we are using so isn't then i said we should know the subject okay so which is our subject here sida so sida is our subject so this subject will change we have to use instead of that subject we have to use pronoun because in the question tag the pronoun should come so isn't see there is a girl so what is the pronoun on there isn't she okay she is a tall girl isn't she and then the question mark okay so this is the way how question tag is formed appa idana question tag nu parayana 
this is question tag and before question tag we have comma okay so we have to see whether the statement is positive or negative next example he is in doing his homework he is in doing his homework is positive or negative yes it is negative because there is is in not one is left upon then what it is a negative statement right and the negative statement should have what kind of question tag opposite positive so even a positive one so comma one comma one pin and then a question tag so positive question tag and we got that it is positive question tag then we have to find out b verb so which is over here b verb is okay so we will use that is you would have negative or a paper positive weather about is okay is then which is our subject over here he so he is pronoun itself so we will use that same thing is he and then we put a mark okay so you would have a positive as well you would have a negative as the question that you would have negative on a certain so our question that will became will become positive okay and our next question is we play cricket every day now in this sentence look at this sentence whether this is positive or negative this is a positive statement right because there is no note over there so here how can you make the question tag over here comma one comma one up in the next is question tag we play cricket every day so which is the helping verb over here we don't have here right we can't find anything so we should also know present tense and past tense so here our verb play now play is present tense or past tense it is the verb which base form of the verb and here it is present tense okay simple present tense and here we have subject plural okay so plural verb so if the verb if the verb is in simple present tense then we have to use do alingil does okay now since here the subject is plural we will use the plural verb so we give a number of do it in a so do and this sentence is a positive sentence okay and so we our question that should be negative so we use don't then our subject here comes to now don't we and then the question mark so that's clear right next one fourth question mother worked the whole day okay here now what kind of sentence it is here it is a positive sentence okay so i'm going to line in the positive sentence on it so our question tag will be in the negative number question tag on that way down it negative formula and here is there any helping verb given no but we have a verb and that is in the past tense right ed form is there past tense so we'll use in the past tense the volume number of verb will be in the past tense it will be did right so we'll make the question tag here we we got the helping verb over here, so we'll add it over here. Did pin a either positive sentence on it, so question tag will be in the negative form. Didn't mother on it, mother the pronoun and say didn't she and question mark. So this becomes our question tag. Hope this is very clear to you. Okay, okay. The next point that I want to make you clear is the usage of am. Okay. Now how will you use when am is given over there? See here example. I am going to be selector. Now this is our statement. And here it is a positive statement. Right. Positive statement it is there. And then our helping verb. And how to form the question tag. We have already we have got over here the helping verb and that is am. Okay. About how will we make? So, am should be there. Am. Okay. Uh, remember in before I know we used here is then isn't. So, in this case, how it will be? Amint, isn't, amint. So, children, 
Please note that it is not am in be right over there. Am, then we will in the case, only in the case of am, okay? Then we will write am, I, not. Am I not at question mark, okay? So this becomes our question back for when we have am with it, okay? So am I not? It is not am in I. Is it set down? Okay, this is wrong. This is the way it is used. Only in the case of am. Okay, so hope children, this section is very clear to you. So we have discussed today four kinds of sentences and question tag. Hope this part is very clear to you. So until our next class, have a nice day. Thank you.